everyone and welcome to another episode of the Legacy Challenge. In the last episode, we had our two little twin girls, Anna Maria and Sasha, age up into toddlers. So they're now toddlers and they really are not identical twins, but I'm so, oh my gosh, guys, they're so cute. But we actually got to expand our house a little bit. So we added a room so each of them get to have their own room now. So we're still trying to get enough money to add some toys and stuff for them as well. So hopefully we'll get to do that in this episode. But also in this episode, I want want us to go ahead and meet our neighbors. They have two twin boys that are the same age as Anna Marie and Sasha, so I'm really excited for us to meet them. Also, we just have to handle the toddlers, you guys. Jake and I, we've got full-time jobs. Ray at least gets to work from home, so that is a good thing, but it just handling the toddlers, guys, is going to be tricky because they are already showing that they're going to be a handful, so this should definitely be interesting. But before we begin today's episode, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Don't forget to turn on your notifications, and don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you are looking forward to this video, and let's go ahead and play the Legacy Challenge. So it is Wednesday. It is 8 a.m. Jake was just cleaning up the mess that our little twins made because they are guys they're making huge messes right now i actually want to change up our looks because it's been a while since we've changed up our looks and then this way you guys can also see the outfits and the hairstyles that i picked out for sasha and anna maria so well, why don't we first let's start with jake's look because i really have not changed his look at all since we first started so guys he's a dad now so I maybe should have like just asked him first if he like what outfits he might be liking here. Is this something he might like? I honestly feel like this might be something. Is this the one that came with the Chinese New Year's or something? Ah, okay, maybe not. That's not really his thing. Maybe the sweater. Is it cold? I think it's like, yeah, it's fall right now. So maybe we should pick some cute fall clothes. So, I mean, I think this might work. This is a little heavy, though. Like, I feel like this would probably be something maybe for... Oh, I don't know, would he wear a cardigan? I don't know. Maybe, like, a jacket? Not really him. I like I like that other sweater. It is a little, like, heavy set, but I think that's oh. fine. Like, it's definitely a little thick, but he'll be at least kept warm. I think for his pants, though, do we need to change this? I don't really have too many options for pants for the guys. Like... There's these, they're a little tight though. Um, what about, I honestly think the pants that he was wearing was fine. But yeah, maybe we should just go with this. Maybe I'll just change the color a little bit. Something, do we want brighter or darker? Oh, they really don't have that many options though. What, mm, okay, you know what? I think I'm just gonna keep the same color. I feel like that's fine. And then the shoes too. Also, maybe we'll change the color of these at least to like brown or something. Although I don't know how I feel about the soles underneath. Do these work? Kind of. What about these? Those also work. I'm not like a huge fan of those though, I'll be honest. But he does have shoes that are kind of like this. Oh wait, no, this one. This one. Brown? Uh, I don't think they need to be brown. I feel like black's fine. I feel like this works. This is a little bit different. His hair, we might be able to change up a little. He like just got a haircut, so his hair is really short right now, guys. It's like it, it's kind of like this, but not like not slicked back though. Like his hair is very spiky at the moment because it's very thick and it does not do what it's told. So I feel like maybe something a little bit more like spiky and up. I did get a, like a lot of new custom con custom content, but most of it is for our Royal series. But I have gotten a lot of new custom content for like since we have picked out their outfits. Honestly, Jake's hair is like kind of like this right now, but like but, but not really. Okay, so his hair is not this long yet, but his hair does get like this. And I think I'm gonna go with this one for his hair. It, it does, I mean, it kind of stands up a lot, not like that much, but I think I'm just gonna stick with this for now and then we can always like change it later. So I feel like I'm gonna do this for his everyday outfit. I think the rest of it, we don't really need to change because like we haven't seen him really in his party outfits. Man, Ray and Jake need to like go socialize more because I have like re rarely seen them in their party outfits. I don't even remember what Ray's looks like to be honest. So, but that's Jake's look for now. Then Ray's, I really do like her outfit though, you guys, like a lot. So she's got like her, this is her first outfit. And then we have, don't we have two? I'm pretty sure we have two. Yeah. And I like both of them a lot. So this is gonna be hard to change. And I haven't really found other stuff like more casual custom content, but I think I am definitely gonna change her makeup. So we have, yeah, I just like start from scratch. So clear out most of it. So this is just like a slight, 
eyeshadow, which I think is fine. Or do we want something a little bit darker? We could go with something a little bit darker. And then so we, I have like the eyelashes now that I love. But like I personally don't have much eyelashes, but I think they look really good on her. And I think some eyeliner is going to look really good with this too. So why don't we do like, I know that's like way too heavy. That's a bit, mm, it's a bit much for a cat eye. But that one's a little bit heavy. I want it to be more up. What does this look like? Nope, that's just adding more, more eyelashes to her already eyelashes. Honestly though, like, why, what's, what's with the eyes? This is, this is hard. Okay, why don't we do this, but then maybe I should change the eyeshadow to something. I feel like this eyeshadow works. Like it makes her eyes look bigger. So I think this might work. Do we want to do like something like cat? I think cat eyes would work too. I like that a lot. Okay, and then lips. So we can do some lipstick. I honestly was fine with the lipstick that we had before. Maybe something just like a little bit brighter. Although these lip colors don't go very bright, but I think this is really cute. And then cheeks, we can do like that one, just the regular blush. Or do we want like highlighter? Ooh, this one. I like this. Okay. So this is her makeup. I really love our hairstyle though, to be honest. It's kind of like just slightly edgy, but I think we could change it up a bit. And then I realized too, cause I was like, wait, why did one of our twins end up with dark brown hair? And it's because that my, it look, my hair looks black with this hairstyle, but it actually is dark brown. So it, it looks like black, but it's not. So anyway, I thought that was kind of interesting. Oh my gosh, guys, my hair does not do this, but oh my goodness gracious, is that long. We have just like that, all oh, this, like the hairstyle just like makes her look so, so different, you guys. Do we want, oh, I'm not used to myself with bangs. I love the Ariana Grande hairstyle. It's so much fun. I don't think though, should I wear my hair for this? I can also do like this. This is cute. This is like shorter hair. Actually, I, although like this hairstyle is like such a, like a, not a mom hairstyle, like you could go teenager, but I feel like she's like just become this mom. So it's kind of looking like a mom a little bit. There's this one too. I like that one. There's also that one, which is basically my hair. Should we just go with this one? I think I like this. Oh wait, but then it changed my hair to black. So now my hair is black. So wait, okay, but wait, did I change my hair to black? No, it's dark brown. Yeah, there we go. Cause my hair, I know it looks black, but it is dark brown. Like in the sunlight and like actual light, can you see? You can kind of see it's dark brown. It is dark brown. <laughs> okay, so I I wish you could just do like highlights. Like in The Sims 3, you guys, there was so much more flexibility. You could add like highlights to your hair and stuff. And it was just like a lot, a lot of fun. But you can't see like your earrings or anything. That's the only bad thing about this hairstyle. Okay, I'm going to continue looking for just a few more, few more hairstyles. I think I'm going to go with this one, you guys. I think I am. Is this like two Ariana Grande hairstyle? I don't know, but I like it a lot. Or, or that's the one she's had before. But I, I liked the first one we had too. I don't have to change it, but I just for just for a bit. Let's just go with let's no not that one. Let's go with this one for now, and then we can pick some other. I want to like just try to remember what custom content outfits I had. So I don't. I don't, oh, I really don't have that many for tops, you guys. But, oh, there's this one. Oh, it's gonna be fall. Oh gosh, no. The hair, the hair, you guys. This isn't gonna work. That's not gonna, oh, that kind of stinks. Well, then what hairstyles? Like literally, no, no hairstyle is going to work unless it goes in, oh, it has to go in the back. Okay, I think we are gonna have to go with this one then. That's fine. That was like one of her first hairstyles. So we're basically changing it back to that. But yeah, cause it's fall now. So I feel like we gotta wear a sweater or something. Honestly, I like the high-waisted jeans with this though. Maybe we could switch it up to, Ooh, are those the only two high-waisted pants that I have? Okay, you guys, I think I'm gonna go with this. So I got these black shoes, but they have like a red inside on the heel. Like the under part is red. So it kind of matches the sweater. And then we have these high-waisted jeans with the sweater. And then I think I'm also going to just change her earrings too. So we have some really, really cute earrings, you guys. So we could do, I don't, these aren't really fall though. These are more for spring and they kind of come down a little bit too too long. Ooh, these are pretty. Ooh, let's go with these. I didn't even know I had these to be honest. Okay. 
Yeah, all right, that's perfect. I like this a lot. So this is her new outfit. She still does have this outfit, but like this is my favorite outfit ever. So I think I'm gonna keep this. Although I'm not like loving the makeup still, like the old makeup, I like our new makeup better. It just like looks better. But I think that that's fine. Maybe we should just give her some, ah, it's okay. All right, yeah. So this is going to be her new outfit. So I do eventually also wanna change like her formal wear, but I can do that later on. So this is her new fall weather outfit, you guys. So for our little twins, so I did change their outfits. So this one's Anna Maria. So I gave her two little pigtails. They're so, so cute. So some of the personalities you guys were suggesting. So some people were saying like, yes, good girl and like, kind of mean girl but maybe one's like a little bit more bookish than the other so i think in this episode we're going to try to determine who is like who is who i still think anna maria is going to be the more like like quiet one like to herself but also like kind of goody goody so that might be anna maria and then sasha is a little bit more out there so this is sasha's outfit so i actually i think i might end up changing this actually because i don't know not this is my favorite so i i did like what the way i have her dress right now is definitely more tomboy for sure but i think we could do a little bit more like like oh this one oh my gosh you guys yes yes <gasps> stop that's so cute oh my god yay okay so i kind of like this one's really cute or should we do like this with the anchors i don't know with the lines and everything this one is like super super busy and it's a little bit distracting to be honest so don't 100 percent know how i feel about this one but it's still really cute maybe we could go with, i honestly liked this one's really cute with the patches and then like this one's also really cute maybe we'll go with the patches one and then i will just change her shoes so they match a little bit better so let's do the red shoes yeah there we go oh gosh guys she's adorable so this one is sasha so i have like their formal outfits also picked out they got like their little onesie their little sun hat so we need to like go take them out somewhere just to have some fun but like this one is anna maria clearly a lot more girly and then Sasha is a little bit, <laughs> Sasha is a little bit more boyish. I cannot get over little children with sunglasses, guys. It's like the cutest thing ever. And then I also gave Bubbles a little bandana. And he's so cute, you guys. You guys, he's so cute. I love him so much. My Bubbles, he's here somewhere. I think he's hiding. But he got a haircut today and they just shaved him. And I was like, oh my goodness gracious. You're like a completely different dog. So he is completely shaven. He looks so different. But yeah, so we have our new outfits picked. Oh my gosh, Anna Maria is making a huge mess. Oh my God, that is a giant mess. Oh my gosh, Ray, no, parent her. Discipline recent behavior, be firm. Tell, not, tell her not to make a mess. Ray, come back and tell her not to make a mess because they are, they keep doing this. I think it's, they're bored, honestly, because we have like no toys for them. So let's buy some toys because they need toys. So we can actually sell our cribs because they're not babies anymore. So we're gonna get a little bit of money from that. And then we can get some toys for them too. So we need to go into the children's category and then toys. Okay, so some toys for them. So I realized guys, they can actually play with the Pokeball which I find extremely adorable. I actually don't know where the Pokeball went. Did it go into Sasha's inventory? Because I think she was the one playing with it earlier. But let's see if I can, ooh, let's get the purple great ball. Oh, it's adorable, you guys. Oh, you can get a different color Ultra Ball. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, cool, awesome. Okay, so we want stuff that is going to be engaging and stuff for them too. So why don't we give this little toddler toy thing? So it's like $300. And then we should also get like a little dollhouse. So this one's a little, this one's cheaper. This one I feel like would work. But oh my gosh, you need a lot of space for this. Like my goodness gracious, why do you need so much space? What? Is it because it's intersecting the door? But like, that's too much to ask you guys. That's too much of a commitment. Okay, well, if I can't fit a dollhouse, then let's get maybe like, where's the little, okay, well, there's the tablet, but that's kind of expensive. We, where's like the toys? Like why, just like activities? Can we interact with stuff? I don't know. These are all for children. Where's like blocks and stuff? Oh, there they are. Okay, these are for toddlers only, but that's fine. So yeah, just give them other stuff to do because they need stuff to do. Let's give them a little stuffed animal too. Can we afford that? Yeah, we can. Okay, 70, $75, that's totally fine. So we can give them a little stuffed bear. So now they have some toys. So now they should be good. 
I think we are all set on the toys. Let's give her also a little a, a little panda toy too. So, I, oh, I wonder if they can like interact with the stuffed animals. View energized work. It, oh, that makes sense. Energy because Pikachu. What about this one? View. Oh no, it's like view sleepy work. Is that a thing? I guess not. Okay. So I think that they have toys now. So hopefully they won't make too much of a mess now. But it is Wednesday morning. I'm thinking let's go ahead and travel to our neighbor's house so they can meet the two twin boys, Lucas and Dylan. So I'm hoping they all become like super good. Oh wait, no, they're our neighbors. So they actually live in Willow Creek. So the D. Salnor household. So let's travel there with our entire family, including including Bubbles, he can come too. So the little toddlers can all meet each other, guys. Okay, so we're at the D. Salnor house. We can knock on the door. Oh, they have their whole house decorated because tomorrow is going to be Harvest Fest. Maybe we should invite them over for dinner. Do we have enough like room though to invite them over for dinner? Maybe we should have dinner at their house and just invite ourselves over. Although they don't even have a dining room table, do they? Wait, no, they, oh yeah, they do, okay, they do. And they have enough for us, like the toddlers don't need to sit or anything. And Jolene, I'm sure she's gonna age up soon too. So, oh, they can also all become friends with Jolene. Oh, Anna Marie can share the love. That's so cute. She's gonna share the love with all of them. Oh, and then Harvest Festival too. So yeah, we need to, decorate our house pretty soon but we can just talk and then jake you guys can talk to the adults because they're pretty good friends now so i think this is going to be like pretty good family friends i don't oh and bubbles was here and bruce just fed bubbles a treat that's so cute okay so sasha also needs to introduce herself although can she because she can't like share the love like anna maria can but she can talk to stranger so like if you keep talking to strangers are they still going to be strangers can you also play, you can also stack, but I don't think you can stack together. Like you can play dolls together, but you can't stack together. So Anna Maria is sharing the love. Look at that, you guys. She is so cute. She's just hugging everybody. I think she's going to go on to her, her next victim now. She's going to go share the love with Lucas. So we just got like little toddlers like crawling around you guys. And they are so, so cute. Anna Marie is adorable. She is for sure like the good one. I think she's super angelic. I think she's gonna be the girly one too. And then she might also be like a little bit more bookish than Sasha. I think Sasha's going to be more of a tomboy. I think she's gonna be more athletic and adventurous. And I think she's going to be also maybe a bit of a troublemaker. Although Anna Marie is the one who keeps making a mess. So I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like Sasha would be a bit of a troublemaker. Stranger danger from socializing. New person alert, new person alert. Quick, I need to get, I need a leg to hide behind. That's so cute. I've never seen them do that interaction though, but that is adorable. Okay, so Ray is not as close to Bruce as Jake is, but oh, argue about parenting. Don't argue about it. It's not that big of a deal. I mean, like it is a big deal, but like you guys need to calm yourself. Where is Marjorie? I don't know where she is. She might be at work, but I think the toddlers can all play with each other. Can they? Yeah, you can play. Sasha's gonna go play with Dylan. Oh my gosh, see? See you guys? They can play with the Pokeball, which I find to be just adorable. That is so cute. She's like snuggling the Pokeball. Okay, Octavia, why do people read books? That's easy because they like the author. You've got a good reputation. Ooh, we can make a great writer out of you. So they're asking Jake to be a writer, but Jake wants to be an actor. So I think we're gonna decline that job offer. He's got his next job in the morning, which is a holiday. So I don't even know, like, would he have off work? I don't think so. But, oh my gosh, Sasha is still playing with the Pokeball. It is so cute, but go play with, go play with Dylan. Wait, you were just allowed to play with him a second ago. Why can't you anymore? Can Anna Maria go play with him? Anna Maria can go play with Dylan. Okay, Dylan walked away and left, but Sasha's getting a toy, or, I, oh, my, oh no, Anna Maria is getting a toy. But wait, Dylan, he just left. Can you come back? And we wanted to play. We could share the love again. Sasha's just playing with the Pokeball by herself, but like, does she want to play with anybody or she just kind of want to be a loner and play by herself? Maybe she is a bit more of a loner. We can ask Jolene to join playing. Sasha can ask Jolene to join playing. Wait, but Jolene's not, not, not playing with her. Wait, it keeps asking us to do all these interactions, but they're not actually doing it. All right, I think Sasha just needs to stop playing with the Pokeball so she can actually talk to people. So go talk, I know they're not really strangers, but just go talk to them. Okay, now Anna Maria is angry and oh my, <gasps> she wants to bite. 
Dylan? Oh no, don't bite him. Oh my gosh, she's angry though. She's feeling so, so angry. And then Sasha's sad. That really hurts. Sasha's heart feels like it's been crushed to a million pieces. Why? Oh my gosh, go talk to Jolene or something. Just talk, just talk, just why? Oh no, they're feeling moody, you guys. Maybe we should take them home. I have no idea where Marjorie is, their mother. She's just not, not here. I have no idea where she went. But we should probably take the little kiddos home because they're starting to get a little bit moody. So I don't know if we, cause like if Sasha or if Anna Maria wants to bite them, that is not, not a good thing. Oh my God, did Sasha just cl crawl into their bed? Why'd you do that? Honestly, their beds are so cute. Oh my gosh, and then Dylan is just creating just like havoc. He's throwing papers and stuff everywhere. We can talk to Jolene though. She's so cute too, but she's gonna age up into a child soon. So I don't know like when that's gonna happen, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be pretty soon. So, I mean, okay, yeah, they've met them all now. So, especially when they like age up into kids, which is probably gonna be in the next episode, um, but they are gonna age up into kids and then we can like, we'll, we'll see how they get along. Oh no, I think Anna Maria has a stinky diaper. So, wait, someone has a stinky diaper. I, or maybe she just, did she? Oh, maybe not. Oh, okay, I thought I saw that she did. Oh, and she's hugging Jolene, you guys. Stop, that's so, so cute. She is adorable, guys. She's just sharing the love wherever she goes. That's adorable. Okay, so I think we're gonna take the kids home. So I think if Ray and Jake just go home, everyone else will follow. So let's go ahead and just, yeah, let's take them home. They're getting a little bit moody. One of them's angry and the other one's sad. So that's not good. Oh no, you guys, Anna Maria just like told off Sasha. She was, just, oh, did you see that? Oh no, she's so angry. Oh my, oh, Jake just finished painting a masterpiece. That's awesome. How much can this get us, you guys? No, we need to sell this. Wait, whoa, whoa, what did I do? Um, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, a thousand dollars. Good job, Jake. Great job. Oh my gosh. Yes, guys, we got some money. Okay, so Ray's making dinner. I need to add a high chair because the kids need to eat. So I need to, oh, let's see. Okay, where do I find the high chair? Is that like, is that here? Um, yep, okay. So these are about $200 each, which I think it, that's, that's fine, I think. So let's put one right, maybe we should like put a place for them at the table, but tomorrow's harvest fest. So do we want, well, hmm, yeah, okay, that's fine. We can do a place for them at the table. So this one is for, can you do that though? Not really. Kind of? Not really. Okay. That one is for Anna Maria. This one is for Sasha. So let's... Oh, oh, you can put it at the table. That is cool, you guys. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. I did not know you could do that. Okay. So, and then we still have, like, room for the table here, too. That's pretty cool. Okay. So we have their high chairs here. And then I'm going to have Jake put Anna Maria in this one. So give food to, oh no, sorry. Put Sasha in that one. We'll give her peas. Oh, did I give her peas? I think I did. And then we will have him put Anna Maria in this one and he can also, he'll give her peas too. So they are both having peas for dinner. Jake also needs to use the restroom. So we'll have him do that. I can't believe he painted a masterpiece and it was like worth a thousand dollars. Also, our computer is broken and I'm kind of worried to repair it on our own. I might hire a repair service just because neither of them have any sort of, what is it called? Handiness level skill. And I don't want them to die and be electrocuted. I really don't. So I think I'm just gonna hire a repair person to come fix the computer for us. Oh my gosh, Sasha has made a huge mess, you guys. <laughs> Look at this, she's made the biggest mess. And like, where's that red stuff coming from? She ate peas, there shouldn't even be red stuff on there. Oh my gosh, what is this on the floor? Did someone put their food on the floor? Is Bubbles gonna eat that if we don't clean it up? Jake, you need to throw that away, but you also need to put Anna Maria because she needs to eat too. She's so angry right now. Oh my God. Oh my God, Sasha just fell asleep in the high chair. <laughs> you guys, oh my gosh. Are we bad parents? We're letting our children just fall asleep in their high chair. Okay, Ray, I think you need to put Sasha to bed. Is that the only thing wrong? She just needs, yeah, she really is tired. So you need to put Sasha to bed. Nighty night, oh wait, oh yeah. Yeah, ask, can you, I guess, like, she's asking them to take her to bed? I'm not 100% sure. Okay, Ray is taking poor little Sasha to bed. Oh my gosh. 
You know, I'm kind of thinking, if Anna Maria has some anger issues, maybe she's the mean one. Maybe. And maybe Sasha's like a tomboy, but still really sweet. I, you know what? I, I mean, maybe. I mean, Anna Maria's been the one to like throw fits. Although she's super clean though. Like she ate her food really clean and Sasha did not. But Jake already fell asleep. So I guess Ray's the one putting Sasha to, or Anna Maria to bed. So put, uh, let's read Anna Maria to sleep. Even though Sasha didn't get a bedtime, but she was just so, so tired. She was falling asleep in her high chair. Oh my God, Anna Maria was like, I'm ready, pick me up. <laughs> it was so cute. Okay, so yeah, Ray is going to read Anna Maria bedtime story. But yeah, maybe Anna Maria is the needy one. Also, I gave her these cute little princess pajamas with Princess Jasmine on it because Princess Jasmine's my favorite princess. And oh my God, is she adorable. So, uh, okay, I think like if we, she's gonna go to bed pretty quickly, I'm pretty sure. Guys, this is so, so cute. Guys, Anna Maria looks so cute in bed. Oh, she fell asleep. She's asleep. Oh my gosh. Ray is like, yes, victory. She's asleep. Oh my God, it's so, so cute. I don't know why Bubbles is barking. He probably needs to go on a walk or something. I'm gonna ask what's wrong to Bubbles. Does he need to go out? Bubbles is looking sad. A hug or a treat might cheer him up. Why are you sad? No, baby. Okay, hug him. And then we can give him a treat too. And he should probably go for a walk. But Ray's getting like really, really tired. And also, please don't wake up the kiddos. But Ray's, Ray's pretty tired. But maybe we could take Bubbles on a short walk. Because he should probably go out. Oh my gosh, it is 4 a.m. Ray's still walking Bubbles. I'm just trying to get her back quickly into the house because she is so tired and she's cold too. Okay, so that was a short walk apparently, but that took like three hours. That was way too long. We're gonna have to take care of this mess in the morning because that's just messy. Ray, go to sleep. You deserve some sleep. Everyone else is sleeping and you have to be the one up taking Bubbles out and everything, but just go to bed. Okay, finally, everyone in the house is sleeping. So, oh, and it is going to be Harvest Fest! We need to decorate our house. I need to get one of those decoration little box things. Okay, Jake's the first one up. Oh my gosh, some gnomes have appeared. I hate these things. Can I delete them? Because I don't like them. We, yeah, they're they're actually kind of terrifying. So I'm just gonna delete all of them. And then I am going to put these little box storage things. We can just put them out on our porch right there. And then Jake can decorate, put up decorations for Harvest Fest. Yay! Okay, so our house is really decorated. Jake has work in an hour. He needs to eat something real bad. Let's see, did someone leave out their food? Should Jake eat? No, that's spoiled. Don't eat that. Okay, let's go ahead and eat whatever is in the fridge. Oh no, did we leave the food out all night? Ray! What is wrong with you? Why'd you do that? Oh my gosh, now the food has gone to waste. Good job, Ray. Go, Jake, eat something else. That's it. There's nothing in the fridge! He has to make something on his own. Oh God, make some egg, like egg. Yeah, scrambled eggs and bacon. Make a party size so we have enough food. Okay, Jake is going, we're gonna send him to work alone even though he probably would have made a lot more money if we went with him, but he actually needs to eat something first. So yeah, you're probably gonna be a little bit late for work, Jake, but you do really need to eat. Wait, oh no, go to your job. Invite over director and co-stars. <gasps> Wait, what did I do? No, you have to go to work. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go to work. How do I make him go to work, you guys? Do I click on him to go? <gasps> Shoot. Uh-oh. Uh, go to work. Oh, thank God. I was like, that's not even an option on here. I don't know what to do. Okay, Jake is off to work. Ray is still sleeping. She deserves that sleep, though. And then, oh, no, she's got to use the bathroom. She has to use the bathroom. Ray, wake up. Use the bathroom. And then you also really need to eat something. And you didn't really get a good night's sleep but maybe you can take a nap hopefully at some point. Oh my God, you guys, Sasha is still sleeping. She's out. She is like just sleeping away without a care. She, and like her, it's already full though and she's still asleep. Oh my gosh. I feel like Anna Maria would like go wake her up. Like she'd be like, hello. Yeah, <laughs> let's wake up your sister. Go ahead and wake her up because she's been sleeping in like way too long. And her sister seems fine with it though. I think she's okay. I think I just love this room so much, you guys. Maybe they should play with bubbles for a little bit. Also, Ray needs to clean though. This is just, this is a mess. We got spoiled food. Ray also needs to work because I think she needs to, what else does she need to do for her career? She needs to finish that science fiction novel. So Ray, you, did, did you already start writing it though? No, right. Okay, so you haven't even started writing this book yet. So you need to. 
So write a science fiction book, Brad. You you can do this. You're gonna make a good amount of money from this, like a pretty good amount of money. So yeah, name your book. Aliens don't need sunglasses. Cool. Okay, Jake's home. Oh my god, are you serious, Jake? You only brought home a hundred fifty dollars. We need to go to work with him next time. Oh my god, is Jake sick? Oh no. Okay, take. Oh no, we don't have any medicine. <gasps> All right, Jake, you need a shower too. You need a shower. Okay, take a shower, and then you need to give Sasha a bath, and then you need- we need to get some medicine for you, too. So give- no, not give Bubbles a bubble bath. Give bubble bath to Sasha. She needs one. Oh, no, but it's- it's Harvest Fest! <gasps> we need to invite over our friends for dinner! <laughs> But, like, Ray is so... Okay, Ray, stop working. You deserve to get some sleep, and you need to take a shower. And then I think we're going to invite over our friends, or try to, even though Jake is, like, so, so sick. Guys, this is going... Oh, gosh, we are struggling so hard as parents right now. They are so new to this. This... They... Okay. He needs to order some medicine so he can feel better. Okay, Jake is taking some medicine now. So he should be feeling much better than, uh, like, after this. And then we need to clean, or you know what? I will help you guys clean. Do not worry. But he does need to have some fun, and he's also kind of hungry. But let's invite over our friends, because I think we are going to have a dinner party. And we're going to have, like, a grand feast. And I'm really just going to invite over the DeSandor family. I hope have they've, like, all, they've met the toddlers, right? Like, we, I hope we can invite them over. So Ray and Jake are going to be the hosts and then our guests are going to be, obviously, our little twinnies. And then, can we invite over the D. Salnor family? Okay, we do. Dylan, Jolene, Lucas, yay! Okay, we got them all. Oh, yay! This is so cute! It's like little family friends! Oh, no, we, we're gonna cook ourselves. And then we will have it at Jake and Ray's house! Okay, cool. <gasps> God, oh, no, wait, I thought Jake just took some medicine! But he's still feeling sick? Uh-oh. That's not good. But I thought you were fine. Okay, well, Jake's feeling a little bit under the weather. I'm going to help them clean because they need help with this. And then I think I'm going to have Jake cook our grand meal. So let's see. Cook a grand meal. Let's cook some turkey. And then I will help them clean. So we finally get to see their party outfits, guys, which is good because we have not seen it yet. So and then, oh, gosh, yeah, we need to clean like all these bowls and help them out with that. Oh, my gosh, guys, they are just struggling as parents. They really are. This is this is all new to them. This is just still new. We still don't know. Oh my god, though. Sasha it has little sunglasses on. That's her party outfit. Is that what I picked for her? And then little Anna Marie in her cute little dress. No, but Anna Marie needs to sleep. You should sleep just a bit, little girl, because otherwise... Oh no, but you, your friends are here. Okay, well, let's see how long you can last. No, but she's sad. <laughs> this is so hard. Okay, just take a quick little nap. Take a quick little nap. And then, and then you can go play with all your friends and stuff. Just, just while we're, like, eating dinner and stuff. Jake is... He's hungry. He really... Oh, but look at their cute little outfits, you guys. They're so cute. Okay, well, Sasha's here. Sasha can entertain them while Anna Maria is sleeping. Talk about favorite color. Babble. Oh, my God, Jake, what did you do? That looked awful. Ray, are you feeling a little bit better? Not really. You do need a shower, though. Please take a shower before you join everyone for dinner because, yeah, take a shower. Take a quick shower. And then Jake is cooking dinner. Anna Maria is sleeping. Sasha is, like, the real host here, guys. Everyone is busy doing stuff. Sasha's going to be the one to entertain all of our guests. Talk to Stranger. You can talk to Bruce. And then you can talk to... Oh, look at Bubbles! Bubbles really likes Bruce, you guys. Talk to Stranger. Talk to Jolene. Talk about trucks to Jolene. And then you can talk to Marjorie, too. So talk to Stranger. And then, yes, yeah, so they are entertaining. Ray's taking a shower. And then she's really tired. But you know what? She's going to be a part of this. Did Jake... Oh, good. I thought he burnt the turkey at first, but it doesn't look like he did. Um, uh, no, that's pretty poor quality. Should Jake try again? This is our first Thanksgiving and the meal is awful. <laughs> Guys, this is like the worst Thanksgiving ever. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. This is a pretty bad day, you guys. But you know what? Oh, no. Bubbles is begging for food. Do not do that. We have to not let him do that. So you need to... Can you uh, pet care or training? No, I have training command. Oh, I thought you could, like, yell at him for begging. Yeah, lecture about begging for food. There it is. And then they even put the little toddlers up here. And then Anna Marie is still sleeping. She's still tired. And this is very poor quality food. And then what is this? Do they just... Okay. Oh, they, they helped themselves to the food. 
I guess we could call to the grand meal and just like tell them I'm so sorry that our food sucks. Oh, Raiden, set the table. Set table, fancy setting, border. Yeah, set the table before we invite everyone to it. And then I will help out with this bowl, even though people are already helping themselves to their food, but that's okay. Ray can still set the table. Although I don't know if she can because Jake's sitting right there. So I guess not, but call everyone to the grand meal. Ray's feeling insecure. I don't know why she's feeling embarrassed. Probably because, what are they talking about? Gosh, she's so paranoid, you guys. She's also tired. Oh my God, but the look at Sasha with that plate of food, you guys, this is so She's so cute. Oh my God. Yeah. Okay. So I think I'm actually going to end this episode here, but we are having like a little bit of family friend guys. Like, look at this. It's like all of our families. They're like our best friends. We could even like take a family vacation together. That would be a lot of fun and super, super cute. So you guys can let me know what you think about our little toddlers. I think we're going to age them up in the next episode. I think that for sure Anna Maria is going to be like the girly one. And then we're going to have Sasha be like the little bit more of a tomboy and a little bit more of an adventurous one. And Anna Maria seems a little sassy and a little mean too. So maybe she could be the mean one. So you guys can let me know what you think. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you did. Don't forget to subscribe and to turn on your notifications as well so you can be one of the first to see when we post a new video and you can be one of the first to comment so I can see your suggestions right away and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye!